Well, first of all, it is a Big Bang model. In other words, there is a Big Bang, but the Big Bang was not the beginning. The common belief is that our universe began around 13.8 billion years ago with an event called the Big Bang. This event kick-started the expansion of the universe, leading to the formation of galaxies, stars, and planets. Eventually, life emerged on Earth within the Milky Way galaxy, sparking curiosity about its origins and the wider cosmos. However, some scientists propose that our understanding of the universe's beginnings might be incomplete or incorrect. What if the Big Bang wasn't the true starting point? What if, instead of being part of an ever-expanding universe, we're actually inside a black hole that came from another universe? This unconventional theory challenges traditional thinking, suggesting that black holes within our universe might serve as entrances to the creation of new universes, implying that our cosmos is just one among many. This may sound an outlandish concept, but this is what famous physicist Roger Penrose says. To understand these ideas better, let's go back in time. Before humanity, Earth, stars, or even light existed, prior to any observable phenomena, there was the Big Bang, an event often described as the inception of space and time itself. Traditional physics posits that there is no before the Big Bang, time as we know it began at that moment. However, some scientists challenge this idea. They propose that just before the Big Bang, all the fundamental elements of our universe, mass, energy, space, and time, were condensed into an immensely dense and compact entity, often dubbed the seed of the universe. Despite its minuscule size, this seed held the potential to trigger the expansion of the universe as we perceive it. But how did such a seed come into being? One intriguing hypothesis advocated notably by Nikodem Poplowski of the University of New Haven, suggests that this seed originated within the extreme environment of a black hole. This idea connects with the concept of the multiverse, which suggests the existence of many separate universes, each with its own unique characteristics and laws of physics. Expanding on this notion, Stephen Hawking proposed an intriguing concept, that black holes might not only consume matter and energy, but also spawn entirely new universes within them. These baby universes could be inaccessible to observers outside the black hole's event horizons, adding an element of mystery to cosmic phenomena. Could our universe itself have originated from a black hole in a parent universe? And if so, does the formation of each new black hole in our universe lead to the creation of more universes? These questions challenge the limits of our current understanding of the cosmos. The foundation of these theories rests on the distinctive characteristics of black holes, particularly the concept of the event horizon, an interface where the laws of physics undergo a fundamental shift. Inside a black hole, matter and energy encounter extreme conditions that challenge our conventional understanding of reality. While these concepts may appear speculative, they offer a stimulating avenue for exploring the fundamental essence of existence, prompting us to reevaluate the origins and composition of the universe. And what about time within a black hole? That becomes evident when observing a peculiar symmetry. Specifically, if one begins just outside the event horizon and moves away from the black hole towards infinity, the distance from the black hole, labeled as R, extends from the Schwarzschild radius to infinity. Conversely, if one starts just inside the event horizon and travels towards the singularity at the center of the black hole, the distance ranges from the Schwarzschild radius to zero. This seemingly trivial observation carries profound implications when considered within the framework of the universe's development. Consider this. The equations governing space and time properties within a black hole bear a striking resemblance to those governing the expansion of the universe. In both cases, distances are measured from a central point outward. Inside a black hole, distances shrink towards the singularity, while in the universe, distances expand away from the initial singularity of the Big Bang. Now let's relate this to the observable universe and its similarity to a black hole. If we were to compress all forms of matter and energy in the observable universe into a single point, it would form a black hole. Interestingly, 
The Schwarzschild radius of such a black hole would closely match the observable size of the universe. This intriguing coincidence leads to speculation. Could our expanding universe be analogous to the interior of a vast cosmic black hole? But the parallels don't stop there. In the mid-1960s, the discovery of cosmic microwave background radiation revolutionized our understanding of the universe. This radiation, with its uniform distribution and blackbody spectrum, provides compelling evidence for the hot Big Bang model. As we trace the universe's evolution backward in time, it seems to converge towards a singularity, akin to conditions within black holes. The convergence towards a singularity, whether within a black hole or during the hot Big Bang, signals a breakdown in our current understanding of physics. At these extremes of density, temperature, and energy, our conventional grasp of reality falters hinting at the existence of a deeper, more fundamental theory yet to be unveiled. Thus, the parallels between black holes and the universe offer intriguing insights into the underlying nature of reality. Could the universe itself be part of a larger cosmic structure where black holes act as gateways between different realms of existence? These questions urge us to venture into the forefront of theoretical physics, pushing the limits of our comprehension of the cosmos. Let's now explore the intricate mathematical symmetries between the interior and exterior of a black hole. Beyond the event horizon, distances stretch from the Schwarzschild radius to infinity, whereas inside, distances range from zero to the Schwarzschild radius. Interestingly, when we replace distance with its reciprocal, or inversely, we find that the characteristics of space within the event horizon mirror those outside and at every point. This equivalence implies a significant connection between the interior and exterior regions of a black hole. Similarly, if we imagine the universe contained within the surface of a perfectly reflective sphere, we get a striking analogy. Just as the entire external universe can be mirrored within the sphere's surface, the mathematical equivalence between the interior and exterior of a black hole suggests a similar encapsulation of information. Now, shifting focus to cosmic inflation and dark energy, these concepts have transformed our understanding of the universe's evolution. Cosmic inflation suggests that the universe experienced rapid, exponential expansion in its early stages before the hot Big Bang. This inflationary phase, propelled by a hypothetical energy field inherent to space, set the stage for the subsequent emergence of the hot, dense conditions conducive to the formation of galaxies and other cosmic structures. Similarly, dark energy is an enigmatic force that pervades the fabric of space, driving the universe's expansion to accelerate over time. Despite constituting a significant portion of the universe's energy density, the origins and nature of dark energy remain elusive. Its persistence, even as the universe expands and becomes less dense, suggests a fundamental property of space itself. The intriguing relationship between cosmic inflation and dark energy sparks speculation about their underlying connection. Some propose that a more potent form of dark energy may have existed in the early universe, decaying before the era of the cosmic microwave background. This hypothesis offers a potential link between inflation and dark energy implying a shared underlying mechanism governing the universe's evolution. Regarding black holes, these cosmological phenomena raise intriguing questions. Could the energy inherent to space within black holes influence cosmic inflation or dark energy? Is there a connection between the formation of our universe from an ultra-massive black hole and the inflationary phase preceding the hot Big Bang? Might black holes serve as the genesis of new universes, contributing to the mysterious fabric of cosmic expansion? Despite the appeal of these concepts, the pursuit of a unified theory of cosmology encounters significant hurdles. While various models and hypotheses have been put forward, none have yet met the criteria of generating unique, testable predictions that set them apart from existing theories. Roger Penrose's conformal cyclic cosmology, for example, anticipates the existence of Hawking points or circles characterized by unusually low temperature variations in the cosmic microwave background. However, 
observational evidence has not definitively confirmed these phenomena. Indeed, the notion that black holes might give birth to baby universes holds both physical and mathematical appeal. From a physical standpoint, it's reasonable to speculate that the extreme conditions within black holes could foster the genesis of new universes. Mathematically, there exist correlations between universe formation and black hole properties, suggesting a deeper connection. One plausible idea suggests that massive black holes from a previous universe could give rise to new universes. According to this perspective, each black hole formed within our universe might potentially generate a new universe within itself. However, despite the theoretical appeal of these concepts, a crucial element is missing. A distinct signature or observable phenomenon that could definitively validate or refute these theories. For theoretical physicists, uncovering such a signature presents a significant challenge. It entails identifying the influence of these speculative concepts on our observable universe and distinguishing them from existing theories. Until this critical step is accomplished, these notions are likely to remain speculative hypotheses, captivating yet unproven. Nonetheless, the idea that our universe originated from the birth of a black hole remains an enticing hypothesis. It's a concept that shouldn't be dismissed outright, given its potential to revolutionize our understanding of the cosmos. Therefore, research and exploration into these concepts are crucial for unraveling the mysteries of the universe. That wraps up today's discussion. If you found this content interesting, don't forget to support us by liking, subscribing, and hitting the notification bell for future updates. Your feedback and support are invaluable as we strive to provide top-notch content and continually improve. Thank you for watching, and we eagerly anticipate your return for our next video.